or was I laughing? Yak Pongsep is okay. a pioneer okay. among brain researchers, establishing emotion as a subject of serious inquiry. I was the first one that ever asked scientifically, what is an emotional feeling? But he's a scientist who spends a lot of time hanging out with artists like San Diego composer Joseph Waters. As someone hoping to bring out strong emotions in his listeners, Waters says that studying Ponksep's theories about the seven fundamental emotions lodged in our brains has been revelatory. Being able to understand uh, our emotional systems at a very basic level and a very deep level uh, has given me tremendous insight and it's changed my way of thinking about music and actually my way of thinking about people. So what exactly can neuroscience tell us about music and emotion? Well, if melancholy music has ever given you the chills, Dr. Ponksep says you have something in common with mothers separated from their infants. The child cries, and that, and that sound actually produces a feeling in the mother that is similar to the child. Feeling of coldness, panic, in a milder form, it's sadness. So it's the sad music that produces the chills. During this weekend's music festival, Dr. Ponksep will be introducing a new piece by Waters. One movement is inspired by Ponksep's famous rat tickling experiments, which proved that these rodents can laugh just like humans. Yak sent me actually this recording of, of him tickling rats, and they actually sent me some, um, some laboratory recordings. Uh, there's the stuff on YouTube, but they sent me the high res stuff. And I was listening to the whole thing, and I thought, let me write a piece about tickling. And it's called Tickle. You can hear Tickle tomorrow night at the First Unitarian Universalist Church in Hillcrest. David Wagner, KPBS News.